Hi, thank you for watching this Inspire 2 tutorial. In this video, we'll look at getting the Inspire 2 ready for your first flight. Connect the power cable to the power adapter. And connect that to the charging hub to charge your intelligent flight batteries. Connect your remote controller directly to the power adapter for charging. When the charging hub's LED indicator stops blinking and turns solid green, it means that your intelligent flight batteries are fully charged. Your remote controller LED will turn off when fully charged. Up to four batteries can be mounted on the charging hub, which charges them in pairs. Download DJI GO 4.0 to your mobile device and connect to your remote controller. To fly your new Inspire 2, you will need the new DJI GO 4 app. Go ahead and download and install it from the Apple Store or Google Play Store. Open the app and connect your mobile device to your remote controller via USB cable. Then turn it on. Install the two intelligent flight batteries in the battery slots. You hear the slots click and see the battery remove button is fully raised. The batteries have been securely mounted. Quickly press the power button five times to exit travel mode. Always choose a flat, smooth surface to enter or exit travel mode. Press the gimbal removal button to remove the gimbal cover. Line up the white mark on the gimbal with the red mark on the gimbal mount on the airframe. Then insert the gimbal into the mount. Rotate the gimbal lock until the red mark on the gimbal is lined up with the red mark on the gimbal mount. The gimbal is now installed. A new clip-in design fixes the propellers in place inside the carrying case to make transportation easier. Pair the propellers and motors with arrows of the same color. Press the propeller lock down and rotate until the arrows are aligned with those on the propeller. You will hear a click when the propellers lock in place. Remember to check the motor lock again to make sure the propellers are all fixed. When you open the DJI GO 4 app for the first time, it will recognize your Inspire 2 and check your firmware version. If there is a later version available, you will see a notification prompting you to update your firmware before flying. You can either update directly using DJI GO or by connecting your airframe to your computer and using DJI Assistant 2. In that case, remember to switch your aircraft to PC USB mode. Okay, we're all set up. Let's go fly. 